You know, this is, really is where I started choreographing. The first pieces that I ever made was a little ballet called The Syncopated Clock for a choreography competition at White Lodge. And I remember we had sort of a big showing here at the upper school and um, my piece was chosen to come up. And I remember at that moment thinking, oh, well, people quite like what, what I do here and it sort of gave me the confidence to start choreographing more. So, um, yes, I choreographed all the way through the school, won the Ursula Morton competition at the upper school and continued on through into my in company days. Golden Hour was uh, originally choreographed for San Francisco Ballet. I think for the uh, for a New Works Festival in 2013. And honestly, it's the music really that came first. I um, had fallen in love with the music of Ezio Bosso um, in uh, his film work. And somehow it sort of pulled me towards the art of Gustav Klimt. I think I'd been to an exhibition in Vienna around the time that I was making Golden Hour. And so something about the, the, the use of color uh, and light and the gold in the work of, um, of the Klimt sort of inspired um, uh, the design elements of this piece. So, you know, there are uh, quite shimmery mosaic -y patterns on the, on the costumes. Um, and then from beginning work on the ballet, like each section sort of started to develop its own little story. In this ballet, there are a lot of unique steps and kind of different shapes that you wouldn't necessarily see in purely classical ballet. And that involves um, a lot of the port de bras also a lot of the partnering is very different to what we might learn in just our usual pas de deux classes. The pas de deux I'm performing in the piece is very slow and elongated. There's no hiding basically, all eyes are on you in this like peaceful duet. So it's definitely a challenge to think about all the technique on top of how you're performing it and the story you're trying to convey and showing the relationship between you and your partner. So there's a lot that I've had to think about whilst doing it, um, but it's been a really fun challenge to work on. Meeting Christopher Wilden was a very fun and insightful experience. I feel like by working with him, we got to really understand the intention behind every movement and every detail. Um, and it just gave us more to think about whilst dancing the piece and to really enrich our dancing.